Good day everybody and welcome to Built Notebook Campers. Yes, I'm sat in my camper again today and it's because, as you can see by the thumbnail, um, I'm giving you, give you some information on the International Camper Van Show and Overland Adventure Show in September. And it's of the weekend, the 18th and the 19th of September. It's going to be a big show. I was at the last one and if you haven't watched my video already, please see the card above and go over and watch that. It was an amazing weekend and I've seen all sorts there. As you will see, I even found somebody towing in a boat. Yep, a boat to the Overlander and International Camper Van Show. Right, the reason I'm bringing out this video to a couple of months ahead of the show um, is because I've got some really exciting news. Now, they're reorganizing the show a bit, so they're gonna have a lot of display vehicles there in different areas. Um, it's gonna be a lot more organized this time. They got really, really overwhelmed by the amount of people that turned up last time. And I must say, the marshals that I saw there, everybody, one of the staff that I met, they was all lovely. And do you know what? They were rushed off their feet. No matter what they were doing, they were rushed off their feet, but they still did it well and to the best of their ability. And they did an amazing job. And um, the exciting news is I was contacted by the organiser of the show who spotted the video that I put out and obviously I think sp spotted my van, the flags and everything, and has asked me to be one of the managers for one of the display vehicle areas. Now the area I'm going to be the manager of is for all those self-built vans. And so basically all the built not bought vehicles. So again, another reason for putting this out is if you think your van is something that you want to show off, open it up to the public to have a look at, and um, you think you'd like people to see what you've done, how you've done it, and talk to people, then there are spaces available in the Built Not Bought area, because the area is called Built Not Bought Campers, so it will be signposted, so anybody look, want, wanting to look at any vehicles that are handmade, homemade, we're not talking coach built, RVs or anything like that, it's literally any vans, lorries, anything that has been built from scratch or from, you know, you've converted yourself. And this is basically an invite to anybody who thinks their van deserves to be on that, that area not so much deserves it, who would like to see their van on that area, should I say. It's not deserved, you know, at the end of the day, everybody's van is their pride and joy. Mine is, I love my van. Um, and every one I build, I seem to fall in love with. And you know, it's gotta be the hardest thing to let them go. You put so much heart and soul into each vehicle. So I know when you people are building your vans, that it's done with every little bit, inch of blood, sweat, tears, and love in your body. And, it becomes your second home. Now, I think a lot of people can relate to that. Some people, it's their first home, they live in the van. But when you build a camper van, I know so many people that will go and sit in their van of an evening and watch telly, and rather sit indoors. Um, many, many people I know do that sort of thing. Or they'll get up in the morning, go out to the van, and go and have their breakfast. Now, all of you know who you are. Um, including me i've done it um i've been working at the unit of a night and it's got to that time and i thought Do you know what i stayed here stayed in my van just because i can and i wanted to so yeah i understand and appreciate totally the love that goes into these vehicles um and you know it's it just becomes a part of you and those that are dedicated to this and love their vans like this will understand what I'm saying. And it's those people that I want to contact me um, or contact one of the organizers. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna leave an email address in the description below. And it's for the guy who's basically saying, um, your van is a yes or a no. So, and Basically, what we want is anybody who wants to 
be parked in the built not bought area i need you to email me photos photos three photos of the outside and three photos of the interior and a little bit of history on your van your build your experiences and um why you think that you'd like to be um a part of the built not bought area now we're looking for yeah we're looking for good stories you know but we're looking for you know vans all sorts i'm not looking for the vans that somebody's gone out and spent hundreds of thousands of pounds on to build it and get it right i want the budget ones as well i want those people that have gone out and recycled stuff built their cabinets out of pallet wood anything so we are literally looking for your proper built not bought campers and if you watch my last video you'll see a proper built not bought camper that even redefined my channel by a long shot and it was a vw transporter and he was towing a vw jetta that used to be his race car he was so in love with his race car that he couldn't part with it and instead of parting with it he chopped it up and turned it into his trailer and that vehicle is something else i say take a look at the the video of the last show that i did or went to oh my god and there is all sorts to see all sorts to do so even if you don't want to display your vehicle please come to the show book yourself a ticket now because those tickets go so quick come to the show enjoy the weekend there's food there's drink uh, there's music there you have overlander vehicles you have um uh, the big american rvs you have four by four vehicles you have coach built you have every type of home on wheels going even trailers um there is all sorts and you know i've, I've never seen such a mixture of stuff you have traders there selling everything for um doing your camp vans lighting you have people selling tents the rooftop tents everything um if you can think of it you'll probably find it there um, cooking facilities there's so much available um, there is showers on site there's toilets on site um, so you will have fun all weekend um, I felt that three days just wasn't enough to get around it all I didn't have enough time to do everything anything if I could have made a proper video of the show it would probably last about two hours three hours even with editing but saying that I've got the chance to go back but this time in a different role and as you come on site if you're part of the display vehicles in the built, built not bought area you'll come to me i'll put you in your spot set you up make sure you're happy i'll be the go-to guy for the weekend for the built not bought campers only just before anybody else is getting any idea but i will be in contact with anybody else so i will be on site i will be around the area but yeah it's going to be a good weekend it's going to be a really really good weekend the last one was amazing um, and this one is the late summer edition and it is the September the 18th and 19th So please you can camp before that um, one or two nights before there is camping on site um, but I think you pay for that as you arrive on site and It's I think you find there'll be a YouTube's village again. There's I say everything that was there last time will be there again I, As far as I'm aware, but if not there'll be more Believe me there'll be more so much more um, I'm really excited about it if you can't guess but like I said if you want to display your vehicle please all I need you to do is the email in the description send three photos of the outside send three photos of the inside of your vehicle explain a little bit about yourself the history of the van um, who you are whether you're a youtuber whether you're a self builder whether you just your van life a full time and living in a self built van, a little bit of a description about you, and um, you will be contacted back. And I'm going to a self build weekend coming up very soon. And if you're there and you see me there, approach me, come and see me. And if you think your van is one of the ones that should be in that self build area or the built not bought area, drag me to your van show me your van uh, tell me a bit about yourself and um i will put you forward for it um i will make sure that um any recommendations that i give will be because i feel that your van will be perfect for my area 
Um, cause I'm all about built, not bought campers. And that's why I named it built, not bought campers. And all I can say is I'm going to look forward to seeing you all there. Just remember, go online, look up the International Camp of Anjo, September 2009, 2021. Oh my God, listen to me, two years behind. So you want the September 2021 International Camp of Anjo, September the 18th, September the 19th. It's going to be a great weekend. I can't say anymore. Um, I'm going to put a few highlights on the end of this video of the last show. Um, but to be honest with you, I probably only put one or two little bits um, that I just, you know, things that amaze me. Go and watch my video. Um, subscribe to my channel. Click the notification bell. Go back through my videos and everything. I have put the card up above. I'll leave the video at the end of this. Have a look at the show. It was amazing. There was all sorts there. And I say, I didn't even touch, literally, literally, I didn't get past the icing on the cake. There was so much more. I hope I see you there. Please look out for me. If you watch my videos and you see me there, come and say hi. Um, have a coffee with me, have a drink with me. I'm not gonna drink too much because I don't wanna get too drunk. And um, I hope you're all having a good day. I hope you all are staying very, very safe and very, very well. And most of all, staying very, very happy. But that's now for me at Built Not Bought Campers. And hopefully I'll see you at the International Camper Phone Show. September the 18th and 19th this year. Please come. Please be there. Book your tickets now. Don't leave it to the last minute. And find they've all sold out. And you can't come because you do not want to miss it. Bye for now.